This creature looks like the result of an evolutionary accident involving the fusion of a fish's head and tail. In fact, you are viewing the entire body of an ocean sunfish, or mola mola. What propels the ocean sunfish is not its tail, but its dorsal and anal fins. The caudus, or the closest structure the fish has to a typical fish tail, is used for changing direction. Other fish belonging to the classification order Tetraodontiforms, such as triggerfish and pufferfish, also use their dorsal and anal fins to aid in propulsion. Unlike its cousins, the sunfish's skeleton is largely composed of cartilaginous material rather than all bone, enabling its growth to a massive size and its title of the world's heaviest bony fish, which now belongs to the bump-headed sunfish Mola alexandrini, a separate species that was recently distinguished from Mola Mola. Another notable fact about the ocean sunfish is its egg production. It was surmised in a 1921 study that a relatively small specimen, around 1.37 meters in length, held around 300 million eggs. However, only a fraction of sunfish eggs will survive to become massive fish. The maximum recorded size for a sunfish so far is 3.3 meters long and 2.3 metric tons. For reference, that's over three times the weight of the average cow and over three yardsticks long. The ocean sunfish is a pelagic species that frequents temperate and tropical waters around the globe. It cannot produce its own body heat and must warm itself at the surface following a deep dive, which can exceed depths of 400 meters. At the ocean's surface, mola can be observed on their sides basking in the sun's rays, but smaller specimens have also been known to jump out of the water. Due to its inability to close its mouth and effectively chew its food, this fish's diet is composed largely of small, soft-bodied animals. Keep this in mind if you ever have the opportunity to hand feed one. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and click the notification bell.